Hey, John here in front of Harlow for a rehab update. As you can see, we've done some work over here in the left carport area. We've got a trench dug out around the slab. And what we're, we're doing this so that we can install what is called a footer, which is a concrete lift that goes 12 inches below the soil all the way around the slab. And we'll run steel rebar cables through it to give it better reinforcement. And if my camera can come into view here, this framing that we've done here, this is a temporary wall to support the weight of the roof line while we pour, pour this footer underneath. And we will keep it there until we install the regular framing, which will go around the perimeter of this patio. And as you can see, the concrete slab right beneath that is pretty thin. You know, it's about four inches of concrete, and over time with the weight of the roof and the framing above it will cause the slab to possibly crack and cause the room to start uh, sagging a little bit. We've also run into a little bit of a hang-up. We had some building code changes, and the city of Jacksonville is requiring us to provide a lot more documentation and information about the house, um, which has slowed us down a little bit, but we should have our permit this week, and we'll be able to resume, resume framing in this room. Now, in the meantime, while we've been waiting, our plumber has come in and installed the new water supply lines throughout. This is the utility room, so that's going to be for the water heater over there, and that'll be for the washer and dry, uh, for the washing machine. The house itself looks pretty much like it did when we started. We've completed the demo. This is all the framing materials for the new bedroom area. We're looking at the back wall of the hall bath where you can see the plumbers installed the new water supply lines and this is going to be a shower pan for our stand-up shower for the master bedroom. Now this week, once we get our permit, we'll be able to finish the framing and our electrician will be able to come in and start installing all of his wiring as well as the AC contractor will be able to come in and install his ductwork for the new bedroom. So hopefully by midweek, we'll have that permit and by next update, we should be somewhere with the electrician and the AC installing their new wiring. So stay tuned.